boys, how are we? Today we're going to be ranking the most attractive NPCs in Roblox Vistaria. This should make quite an interesting video. Before we begin though, I need you guys to like and subscribe so we can get some more banger videos like these. And also, put in the comments who you think is the hottest NPC in Roblox Vistaria. And uh, yeah, enjoy. Alright, so uh, here's the tier maker right here. I tried putting it in the actual like tier maker like website or whatever, but I can only have up to 9 NPCs. And you know, there's a lot more NPCs than that in Roblox Vistaria. I didn't cover all of them, just like the most attractive kind of ones, you know what I mean, right? Alright, first we have Monsieur Fred. Uh, this is a pretty blurry picture, so I'll just pop one on screen. Um, I think he has some green flags i think he has some red flags personally some of his better highlights i'd say i really like his suit it's really nice it's very attractive i also like the fact that he's very rich and i think he can support me in a relationship i think some of the bigger red flags is it seems a little bit like a under market shop like some of these trades seem a little unfair if you know what i mean and which gets me questioning maybe this is illegal and I don't want Monsieur Fred to, like, drag me down with them. So that's why I think he's a solid B-tier material right there. Next, uh, we have Karen, right? Uh, a very interesting NPC. Uh, personally, not a big fan. I think it might be the, just, buff arms. I think that, I think she could beat me up. I think that might be what it is. Maybe. I don't know. I kind of just don't like her pose or her overalls or anything. I think I'm gonna put her in a D-tier. Cat girl. A list, A list right here, definitely. Why I'm not putting her in the S tiers because there's someone very special reserved for that spot. But I like the lot of the, you know, I like her outfit. I like her. She, I, she has a great personality. That's what I'm saying. She has a great personality. Okay, right here is uh, William Pumpernickel. Um, he's interesting. I think he's attractive conventionally attractive um i like his hair i like his stance it's a very alpha like embodied stance like you can tell he watches andrew tate and i'm into that the only red flag is is that he's probably gonna end up in jail for being a human trafficker <laughs> only issue other than that though solid a tier okay next up we have tyler um, I feel like Tyler, he's a very mysterious soul. I feel like, I feel like there's a lot of backstory that we're not missing, which imposes that this character, this, this boyfriend material, he's a lot deeper than he appears, and I'm into that. He could tell me things. He could teach me things. Yeah, I, I think Tyler, I think he's a solid B tier. A tier, I like his hat. I like his hat a lot. It, it's really attractive. We have the evil scientist. I feel like... He would kidnap me and, like, do experiments on me, which I'm not into. So, but I do like his umbrella and his glasses and his hair and everything about him. Um, I like the fact that he's shirtless a lot, but those red flags are there, so I think he's a solid C. Okay, we have Admiral Hugo. Look at those boulder shoulders. I, he could, you know, he could do things with me, right? Um, I like his hair, his beard is very attractive. The only thing I don't like is the fact that he looks like he has anger issues. So I'm gonna put him in a B tier. Um, let's see, Ethra, Ethra, Ethra. Um, she's cool, I guess. I, but she's only there for her personality, you know what I mean? But I bet she has a great personality. It's not, though, so I'm putting it in a D tier. We have the Rat King right here. Uh, he's a little savage, but, you know, I could maybe work that into my schedule a little bit. He's cool, I guess. I think the bucket hat isn't giving him any points, though. Overall, C tier. Okay, uh, we have Greybeard, the wizard. He's kind of giving me Gandalf vibes, and Gandalf looks like he knows how to throw down. So I feel like he would beat me up, but at the same time, I feel like he'd use his magical spells and, like, give me a lot of money. I like him for his money, is what I'm saying. So, A tier. Alright, uh, next we have Tal Ray. Um, he's a interesting free spirit. I, th I think that's what I'm saying. He knows how to defend himself, and he doesn't take anything from anyone. My only problem is that he's an immortal god, meaning when I kick the bucket, he's gonna move on without me. And that makes me feel like he's cheating on me. And we can't- I don't stand cheating unless I'm the one doing the cheating. So, I'm putting him in an F tier. He's a cheater. Red flags. Okay, uh, next we have Dr. Astley. Um, I like his glasses. Very cute suit coat. Um, 
only issue is that I don't think he's ever seen sunlight before, and I like long walks on the beach, and I don't think he does. But what redeems that is his dogs are out. So C tier. <laughs> All right, the one we've been waiting for, Taxi Man Dave, immediate S tier, immediate. He is so attractive. Look at those biceps. Look at those quads. He goes anywhere. No one stops him. I love him. He's a god. We have major bicep right here. Um, I feel like I, I like his armor. He's a very, very strong person. My only issue is I feel like he'd make me do push-ups. And there's a limit. You know, there's a limit. So I'm gonna put him in B tier. We have Mayor Noah. I, I like his mustache. The green goes really well with him. Uh, I feel like he's a very attractive man. He's giving me, like, you know, older, retired Ryan Reynolds vibes, right? Attractive. The only thing I don't like is I feel like the power's gone to his brain. He just likes bossing people around and standing there. You know what I mean? So B tier. So we have Scruff. Um, I feel like he's a little old for me. That's basically it. He's way too old for me. Yeah. F tier, uh-huh, you can get together with Tal Ray, how about that? Okay, uh, now we have Zero, Zero, I don't know how to pronounce your name, maybe that's what we could do on our first day, you could, like, teach me thing, you know, teach me your name, and I could teach you some things, you know what I mean? I hope she's like, you know, is it a he, a she, I don't really care at this point, right? But as long as they're picking up what I'm putting down, I'm okay with it. Uh, very mysterious, uh, probably could have a lot of good deep conversations. The mask probably isn't helping, though, so that's why I'm putting you B tier. Next is Vincent. He looks a little angry all the time. His suit's nice, but his face is a little hard to look at a lot. Very punchable, like, you want to break it, you know what I mean? But he does look wealthy, and he could support me. He could take care of me. So he's going in the C tier. Admiral Hugo, I think that's what his name is. Correct me if I'm wrong. Don't really remember. Just like I don't remember his name, he's a very forgettable person. I'd feel like I'd accidentally cheat on him because I'd forget he kind of exists. You know what I mean? There's nothing wrong with him. He just... He's just there. D tier. Now we have Horsehead. Um, not the most attractive person, um, but I like that his buff arms are out, you know? I, I like his snout, or whatever you want to call that. Very appealing. Now we have Brutus, the city guard. I feel like he would just abuse his power over me, and wouldn't let me into Nilkarf. I have trading to do. So, I think that's an immediate F tier. Just red flags overall. N would not recommend dating. Okay, last, we have the stranger. I like his blue eyes, they're a touch, but I feel like they kind of just stare into your soul a little too much. The golden belt buckles on his, like, chest or whatever, it's a nice touch, it shows that he has wealth there. Not sure what's up with his hand, but maybe that could lead into a great opening conversation, you know? So, we'll put him, we'll put him eight here, I can't think of any real flaws in him. You know, W boyfriend. Okay, so that was the list. Let me know in the comments what you think you would have done better or what you would have put on that list. Give me your own list, in fact. Just type the entire thing in the comments. If you want more videos like that, let me know. I was thinking of maybe also doing a mob version of one. Or maybe we could do, you know, the least attractive NPCs, you know? Other than Tal Ray, of course. I hate that guy. Make sure to like and subscribe. Join my Discord server. Links in the description or channel banner. And, uh, yeah. Peace.